What up, YouTube? Thanks for tuning back into the channel. Hey, I'm just leaving the dentist, all right? First of all, let's talk about the dentist. I went to the dentist, I sit in the chair, they put the little thing around me, put the sunglasses on me, and then they come to me and be like, uh, we have a problem. See, I'm trying, I'm trying. I had a tooth pulled, and I'm trying to get a partial for it, because I can't be having no holes in my teeth. You understand what I'm saying? I'm smiling at the camera. I can't have y'all looking all in my teeth. And I got, anyway, I'm trying to get a partial. The boy's getting old. When I say portions, I feel like I'm a grand. I'm trying to get a, a permanent portion, you know, when they drill up in your bone and put it. They get in there and they tell me that the hygienist is busy and got like two patients and I'm gonna be waiting two hours if I wanna wait or I can come back. That's all right, I'm gonna come back. I'm thinking come back is tomorrow. They're gonna tell me, well, June the 28th. That's more than a month away. Anyway, I've ran a little bit. Uh, it's not an emergency, you know what I'm saying? I ain't hurting or nothing, you know what I'm saying? So I ain't tripping for real, but come on now. I've been waiting for a while for that appointment. Then when I get there, they want to send me out. Rant over. On my way out to the dentist, on my way to the dentist, I go at my subdivision and I see yard sale. And there's somebody on the corner having a big old yard sale. And I couldn't stop because, you know, I would have been late for the dentist. So I'm on my way back, all right? Now, it's like 1 o'clock in the afternoon. And if I would have known, I'm actually off today, too, and it's on a Thursday. If I would have known that they was having yard sale, I would have been there right at, I could have walked there. You know what I'm saying? So I'm sure whatever's there is already gone, but we're gonna go back anyway and see if we can pick up some gems. You know You can actually see it. Yeah, that's better, ain't it? That's better. I'm back at the crib. Um, okay, let's talk about this yard sale, all right? First of all, I'm mad that I didn't go at 8 o'clock. I overheard the guy talking to somebody, talking about all the stuff they had this morning. Like, you should have been here. It was all kinds of stuff. Somebody came and cleaned out. And that's when you get lucky. When you go to yard sales, that don't nobody else know what's going on. Nobody else is there. He just buy up everything. And they usually give you a good deal, right? Because you're the only person there. They probably don't feel like that your sales is going to do anything. They give you the best deal of the world. Anyway, let's not talk about that. I did get a few things. There was a lot of knickknacks there that I could have got. Y'all know me. I'm just trying to get the next best thing, right? Let's talk about what I got. 
a lot of this stuff i don't even know what it is right let's talk about these i got some well first i went and i got this thing right here this is a if i can get it out the bag this is a twink uh, tinkerbell tinkerbell 2008 and it's never been out of the package all right um I looked, I paid three dollars as you can see. I looked them up and it was a fast look up. There was one with a blue box, it was worth a lot of money. And then there was one like this one right here that's worth. Well, just look it up while we sitting here, alright? I'm gonna get my phone, do a Google lens. Let's see what we see. Alright, let's go to Google. Hit that. Let's do a lens. Or I could just say what the heck it is. Here's Google Lens. There's a blue one. That's what I seen at first. I was like, nah, that's not what I got. Blue box is the pink box, as you can see. $99 on eBay, right? But then I see this one right here. Look. 60 with an asterisk by it, which means it's probably not what it's selling for. Let's go there. Somebody selling one. And mind you, my box is not the best, but it is new. This box looks mint. It's going for $6 with $50 shipping on it. Where is this coming from? $50 shipping? Denver, Colorado? Why is it shipping so much? Do y'all see that? Just let me say what this is, all right? Tinkerbell and the Lost Treasure. I really can fly figure. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is more like right here. $35.95. Let's go to the ones that's already sold. Uh, look, thirty dollars, ten dollars shipping, thirty nine ninety nine, ten fifty five shipping. Uh, so yeah, it's two didn't sold right here. Uh, let's see how many's listed. Let's see what the sell through rate is. Send zeros listed, but clearly there's one right here listed. Anyway, so there's not that many on here, all right? So I figure it's one listed. I sell mine, I list mine for 40, I pay $3 for it. That's a win, that's a win no matter what I sell it for, even if I sell it for $30. All right, so we got that. And then, what else did we get? Oh, we got, did I buy that first? And I came back and bought this, I bought this camera right here. Now this is an interesting one too, you know, older cameras, not all old cameras are worth money. Matter of fact, most old cameras are worth no money, but there is a lot that's worth some money, all right? This one was $7.50. Uh, it comes with a flash that doesn't have a bulb in it and some paperwork. Oh, I got a bulb right here. So it comes with, look like everything. And then, oh, let's see what's in here. There might be a couple $20 bills. Stuff this. No. <laughs> let's see what's something in here. But you gotta go through all the apartments, man. I found money just chilling in compartments. So, you gotta look for them all. Nothing in there. All right. So, we got this camera right here. You open it like so. And it's one of those ones that come out. What's that called? Uh, accordion style cameras. I don't even know how to get this out, so I'm not gonna do it. But anyway, let's see what Google Lens got this selling for. I looked it up quickly. Um, that's why I wish I I wish I was there that morning of the yard sale. Okay, uh, so this one's seven fifty. Let's find some eBay stuff. Sixty two dollars. This one says twenty dollars. So this might be a bust. But let's go to eBay. Let's not jump the gun. Polaroid automatic two fifty land camera, vintage. You gotta throw the vintage in there, right? So look, here's one to sell. Well, first of all, let's go to what's sold for. Let's see, we got 127 results, all right? Let's go to, okay. <laughs> it's not looking good. One was at $21, it got zero bids. 39, zero. Zero, zero. There's no greens, what are greens? $26, no greens. 1450 so it's looking like this is gonna be a bust all right this is just gonna go in a pile it does got this right here you know what I'm saying? this will probably go in the pile of my other cameras and i'll probably sell those on whatnot um or i might just list it on ebay for like 
thirty dollars since it got the case and see what happens. The best stop from you know it does have a flash and everything too, but there's like a hundred and twenty seven on here. So yeah, uh, like this one got look. Somebody got one list for eighty with some extra stuff. Fifty, twenty one. Can you do something for me? Nah, I'm just playing. All right, so anyway. You gotta see what's up there. But sometimes you just gotta take a chance. You know what I'm saying? You gotta take a chance. You know, I took a chance and it didn't work out. I'm sure everybody on here who resells, it happens, right? But we're still not done, all right? I spent $20 for everything, all right? $20 even for everything that I got here. Four different things. I got these brass things. I think these are brass. Are these brass? Yeah, solid brass collection from Korea. Uh, Leonard. And this looked like a little mouse. I got a bunch of these. Look. That's another little mouse. Looks like they got a little oxidation on them or whatever. Just trying to sit in. What is that? Is that a bunny or a deer? Looks like a mouse. So yeah, I got all these brass things. That's a pink one right there. And I don't know if I can find these for Google Lens. Google Lens, I've just been using lately just to see uh, if I can actually trust it. Because <laughs> Google Lens, sometimes, man, they can get you. You know what I'm saying? So, um, $12. That was a shined up one. Uh, I don't know. These are just solid brass figures. Uh, you know, some of them are worth, well, I see that, I'm going to say 42 on Etsy. Uh, I don't know. So this is just be something I have to look at. These look like a win. I paid $7, and there's still three more in there. I paid $7 for these. Uh, I might be able to get a printed penny all out it up together. And also, these right here, these are some old brass handles and stuff like that that some people look for to put on certain things. Uh, I don't even know what to do about going about looking these up, so I'm not even going to try. Uh, at the end of the day, I mean, I'm going to be in a positive. That right there is going to sell for about 30 or 40. These are going to sell pretty good. Uh, I'm just going. I don't know what I'm going to do with those. I'm going to look them up and see if I can find some handles. And this right here is just blah blah blah. <laughs> anyway, man, y'all like, comment, subscribe. This is just a quick video of me going to a random yard sale that I didn't know about. And um, yeah, you just always got to be on your toes and ready to go when it comes to this resale stuff, all right? I do it part-time, so I can kind of just chill and have fun with it. Oh, you can have fun full-time too, but you gotta be serious and make sure you're doing your listing and doing all the stuff you need to do uh, in order to make a living, right? So um, maybe one day I get there and uh, stop messing around. Y'all be good. Peace.